Tonight's game three of the Pacific Oz Sports Initiative Tri-Series Futsal. Futsal is a small-sided version of football. It's a different sport. Um, it's, it's 5v5. More dynamic like basketball in terms of the amount of opportunities, the amount of 1v1s, the amount of dribbles, the amount of action. You don't sort of have a time to switch off like you do in football. Um, and, and yeah, it's just it's non-stop sort of end-to-end -end action. You're always on the ball, you've always got a job to do. It is football, but it's just 100 miles faster. So this uh, international futsal series has come about through the Australian government's Pacific Oz Sports program. Football Australia's had a long-standing relationship with the Solomon Islands through this program, starting with uh, a tour that the Junior Matildas did in 2019, the Pacific Step Up Tour. Playing against Solomon's has been terrific. They've been very technically skillful and, um, and powerful. Their ability to, to operate in short spaces and, and their, their speed of movement, speed of thought is, is excellent. I think, uh, I think their tight skill, solo foot, is, yeah, is really impressive. Playing against Australia, it's very exciting and I think we, we, um, we really enjoy uh, I mean playing against the top quality team. Solomon's, uh, I guess, in the, in, in the region are a powerhouse, so they're, they're probably the strongest team. Um, and, and they've gone to, I think, f maybe four consecutive World Cup cities now. It's been challenging for us and, and, and we've had some good games. We don't get many opportunities to play at home. So this is, this is really, really valuable to, for the players to be able to play in front of their family and friends and the, the whole, whole futsal community. It's fantastic. Like these types of opportunities bring together both countries to uh, experience good competition on the field uh, and then strengthening relationships off the field. If we had something um, like this series that we could look forward to every year and sort of cement it in and that, you know, put it on our calendar, establishing a connection like that would be huge. Well, congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. And uh, I, I wish you well for um, the rest of the games you're playing this year. Thank you very much. It's, it's a good experience uh, for the young boys. Our youngest was 16 years old. It will really help them uh, grow individually and as a team. The ideal scenario would be, be to have sort of each year we sort of have a, have a three-match series between us and have that connection become, become stronger and stronger. The better they are, the better we can be. Their competition's key like that. We make each other better. Hopefully, uh, maybe uh, Australia can come to Solomons and we can have uh, a series back home experiencing what our, our people can offer, especially with futsal and with the uh, atmosphere back home. This team means everything to the people in, in the Solomon Islands and with that, you can do so much. The kids back home, they, they, they really want to aspire and be, become national players so that they can one day um, represent uh, our country in, in more stages. It's a country with huge potential, not just to go to another World Cup, but to actually go to World Cup and, and compete. And, and that's my dream for, for the next World Cup, for the next two, three World Cups, to take this team to, to World Cups and, and compete and, and break into the top. 40, 30 rankings in the world and, and there's, there's the talent, there's the desire, there's, there's the support to do that, so there's huge potential. Yeah.